Ted Hunsaker here um, from Oracle Park. I'm at the um, Angels versus Giants game. It looks like there's a team bus behind me getting off the bus. I think it's the Angels because they take batting practice about two hours before game time. And the Giants are going to be taking batting practice pretty soon. So I'm going to be heading out there and um, on to McCovey Cove and seeing if I can get any balls tossed down or maybe some bounces. So I think the lady was approaching me or something like that and I don't want to <laughs> uh, get into uh, record something I should be recording so I'm going to move over here. Uh, right behind me is a statue. I don't remember who it is. It's maybe Willie Mays or McCovey, Willie McCovey. But um, I'll put on the, uh, the video. So I'm actually going to be renting a kayak tonight um, for the game starting at 6 o'clock to 8.30. Um, I was looking for one of those inflatable kayaks I could um, use to float around, but during this this craziness going on, there's like low on stock and high demand of this stuff. So I decided just to rent a kayak for tonight. I'm going to see what it's like. And I'll probably do it again tomorrow. So I'll see what happens. I'm looking down at the board rock walk right now. I can't really talk in these masks. I mean, I don't know if you can really hear me, but I'm looking down at the boardwalk. It looks like there's quite a few people down there. I don't know if they're um, doing the same thing, like um, waiting for balls or stuff, um, but I'm going to try to get a ball during batting practice before I have to go on the kayak for the actual game. I was hoping that I'd do it, be able to get on the kayak during the entire BP end of the game, but I couldn't do that because that's um, they're not really flexible with that, um, or the door's not open. It's only open like um, during the weekends and on Monday. so couldn't do that. Looks like we have a kayaker here. Um, I don't know, it looks like he's on one of those inflatable kayaks. Um, it doesn't look like McCubby Dave. I think McCubby Dave may come out soon, but I'll get, get a shot at him. He's um, very famous. An ex-HP employee that um, um, makes <laughs> holds a record for catching um, splash hits. So I'll definitely point him out to you if I see him. Usually you could see through the gates, but they have them covered off so you can't really see through the ballpark. But if you come over here, you may be able to see some balls come over. This is the foul line, um, foul pole right there. So it would definitely it would be in foul territory, but you can see where the balls are going. You can probably see some balls as they um, approach the view the line of sight or whatever. Okay, so it looks like we have some Japanese um, um, broadcasters or something. It looks like they have a big camera. Probably something for Otani or something. Because it seems like they're... This is first. This is very first time actually playing at the stadium. So it could be something big for him. And speaking about Otani, he could very well hit his first home run out of the stadium into the McCovey Cup because he's a lefty. So I definitely want to be out there for this tonight. Maybe even tomorrow. So maybe I can grab his um, first ever home run ball. Um, it's going to be kind of hard because I'm not a pro maneuvering like some of these guys out here that have been doing every single day. Um, I'm a kind of a new kayak. I, mean, I do kayaking, but I don't really do that kind of ball hawk kayaking per se. So that would be a great. You just got to be in the right place at the right time. I don't know if you can see it or not. It's around 346 right now, so it should be about the time they start batting practice usually, the home team. So I'm just waiting for some balls to go over this fence. Maybe they'll get a bounce down to this ground and of course they'll probably hit the water. Or maybe they'll toss it down, who knows. It's actually an area of the stadium you actually see through barely. It looks like they're um, getting batting practice ready. Looks like they're gonna have batting practice pretty soon. Um, I get an idea so I can come back around this time uh, tomorrow. Barely see, I and mean, it's like night. Now we got three kayakers out here waiting. Um, thought I heard a ball like come down right there. I'm gonna have the GoPro on. I'm gonna probably push play on it pretty soon. There's some placards on the ground on the floor. We got um, a home run ball. Bonds, all-time season home run champion. Four 
527 right now. I haven't seen a single ball go over. Batting practice usually would have started at 330 something, 340. Um, maybe they're not swinging for the fences. I did see some balls land and hear some thuds going on. I don't know if those were baseballs or maybe they're just not swinging for the fences. I have not seen a single ball come out of the stadium. Um, I'm sure the Angels will probably hit it out, especially Shohei Otani will probably blast it into the Cubby Cove. Come on, balls. We're getting bored out here. <laughs> yeah, these kayakers are hungry for balls. Yep, we're all hungry for balls. Looks like that guy got a ball for batting practice. Right there. So I think that's one ball for the day that went over. So I'm seeing the Angels taking their warm-up drills right now through the um, whatever I can see through the transparent fence. Um, and yeah, they're just doing their stretches and whatever they need to do to warm up. Okay, so I am heading, i uh, going to get some food to eat. Um, it is a little past five o'clock. I do want to get food to eat and uh, so I can be ready for the, uh, the kayak appointment at uh, six o'clock. We will be going out uh, before the game. It's going out to late 30. Okay, so I'm paddling out to McCovey Cove right now. Um, that's pretty nice. I'm like the only guy that um, reserved it. I don't know. I may do it tomorrow. Um, over there game time starts at 6 45 so I should be there in time I'm gonna take this and pull this mask down um, I think you can pull it down when you're in the kayak I don't want to be wearing that if I took tip over it may be a drowning hazard yep so I'm gonna there's a uh, Oracle Park okay he says keep the paddle low so I don't get my pants all wet Don't want blisters. I mean, <laughs> I don't have a net. Um, <laughs> I just have my hands to grab the ball. Should get a net. Go for the boats. Keep the rope in the kayak. We're heading to McCubby Cove. I wonder if that's McCovey Dave. My, uh... I wonder if they'll see me on TV tonight. are taking the field now. And we have a lefty up. I'm going to be recording these as these lefties come up. Left, right. Okay, so it has left, right. That's left, right. Left. See it right there. Mike Trout, anything's possible with this guy. 
Right, he's right-handed, but he has power to the off of <laughs> It in here. this year. So this mascot who was um, shooting something, I actually was able to get one of these things. I'm gonna open it up when I get back to the shore, see what I got. So that was a nice souvenir, at least to get something uh, for coming out here. Yeah, there it is. Where it's Cinco. <laughs> <laughs> That's one official Major League ball. I've gotten two at the um, uh, the um, the alternative field for the Angels. So I've gotten two of those and one of those. So I've got a total of three, but this is the first Major League official uh, Major League um, ball for a Major League stadium. Awesome. Oh, he could tie in Willie Mays tonight. <laughs> That'd be awesome. He offhoed it into here. 300 home run. Sick. Really amazed. Tie home run. We making history tonight. More likely, they probably won't, nobody will be able to get it. Unfortunately, that's what sucks about this situation. So it's the uh, must be ending over. I'm wondering how many balls are down here. There's like maybe times I've seen on TV or YouTube that there's nobody out in the cove. The balls can only float for one minute and then they sink into the depths of the bay, into the cove at the bottom of the cove. Some sunflower seeds are pretty nasty. Um, so I'm sh I wonder how many balls are down there. Um, I do. I'm a certified diver, so. I don't know if you can dive down there or not, but it'd be great if I could. And <laughs> get balls that way, probably the easiest way to get a baseball. <laughs> it's the easiest way to get a souvenir. <laughs> so I'm heading back to uh, the dock. I'm supposed to be back by 8.30 um, for the agreement with the rental, the kayak rental company. So it should take me about 15 minutes to get back. I decided to set the alarm at 8.10. I should be back probably early I 
did accomplish what I want set out to accomplish this week. And get a ball and also got another souvenir to um, put a cherry on top of it. <laughs> oh, he's on top of Trout. You better get going, Trout. <laughs> you better catch up with Tatis. <laughs> um, I could probably use the rest of this GoPro. I'm like, um, I was thinking I was about 50% left. So it should be plenty enough to get me back to the dock. I gotta watch out for the boats. <laughs> Pretty easy to get back. I mean, you just gotta follow that wall. <laughs> Trump. <laughs> Some nice shots here. <laughs> nice view of the Bay Bridge. Mm -hmm. Home run. It looks like they're being blown out. Like the Giants hit another home run. See the um, water go up. Five nothing Giants. The Angels getting blown out. They've had not had a good year. Neither of those teams have had a good year. Giants are in the cellar. Angels are flirting with the cellar several times. So neither teams have been doing well this year. good radio I mean does the job it's like 12 bucks on Amazon <laughs> the shower for a radio radio for a shower I mean <laughs> shower for radio <laughs> so I'm back at the hotel room had a successful night in McCovey Cove got two souvenirs uh, the first thing I got was this little hat thing you put over um, probably keep it's probably good for the kayakers it keeps them warm you can actually uh, clip that and wear it and the funny thing is it says uh, beat LA which um, the Angels are they call them the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim so they're really not a Los Angeles team they're in Orange County but it says beat LA so that kind of makes me laugh. It says commemorative logo of the 60th anniversary on the top of it, which is pretty nice. Um, the next thing I got was this um, baseball. It looks like it was um, from batting practice. I think it's from batting practice, otherwise it'd be mud rubbed. It's not mud rubbed, so it's definitely batting practice. More, more than likely batting practice. A little scuff mark on there by the uh, on Major League uh, logo. So, if I count Major League Stadiums where I got balls from, that would be my 17th ball I got from Major League Stadium. I did get two other balls at a, um, at a practice facility, the Angels practice facility in Long Beach, which I did a video of um, one of them I got. Um, I got one of them at that one, and then the next one, I think I went a couple weeks later. I, did, I didn't film that one. I did get another one. Um, so, if you count all the balls, that's three balls this year. One at a Major League Stadium. Uh, total balls would be 19 balls. Uh, lifetime balls for me. Major League balls, that is. So, I want to thank you for watching this video. Uh, please leave a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you haven't already so you can get future videos. Um, I was thinking about going, but the uh, the kayak rental, City Kayak, um, said that there wasn't enough um, demand. I was I was like I was like the only one out there, and there was another person that came late, so I was lucky that they didn't cancel on me. It was nice of them that they let me go out and have a good time and actually make this video for you guys. Um, I was gonna rent a, I was gonna buy a uh, inflatable kayak, but it was kind of hard to find at retail. I did find one, like last minute, but it wasn't gonna arrive on time because Amazon doesn't do really do two day shipping, more like two week shipping because it seems like they're really focused on essential items, and that's really not an essential item. So, 
So anyways, thank you for watching this video. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already. And leave comments below if you got any balls yet during this um, 2020 season. Pretty weird season. It's kind of difficult to get a ball unless um, you go to San Francisco, Wrigley Field, or Fenway Park where you can actually get balls that leave the stadium. Even Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania too. Pittsburgh Pirates, PNC Park. So anyways, thank you for watching the video and have a great day.